Hey, it's Sean Dash Warrior. Um, I just thought I'd read you this review. Um, Kai actually showed me this on Skype, and I actually am on Skype now, so if you hear any notifications, it's from people I'm talking to. But yeah, um, I just thought I should show you the... <laughs> I'll give you the link down in the description, and I'll, you know, fucking tell you who told me this too, yeah, Kai. And I'll, you know, give this channel down below. That's what she said. But yeah, okay, here goes. So this is an 8... Uh, Anne Summers realistic 8 inch dodo review <laughs> and the overall rating is wow almost four and a half star yeah four and a half stars um okay the title says oh gave it five stars but it ruined her life and it says I brought this product because my husband whom I dearly loved was sadly not a particularly well endowed fellow, and I was seeking greater satisfaction in the bedroom. So, one week while my husband was away on business, I had a tipsy moment of uncharacteristic adventurousness, and I ordered the product. When the product arrived, I was startled by the size. After my husband's measly four incher, I didn't know if it would fit. But with lubes and a lot of patience it did. Yikes. And boy was it worth it. It I don't work and as a housewife I spend most of the following week playing with my new toy. Everything changed when my husband came home. He saw that the house was not as clean as usual. I usually spend most of my time making it spotless but that week I was distracted and immediately I knew that something wasn't quite right. Uh, quite right. He asked as to why I hadn't shampooed the carpet. I told him that I had been ill and but I was feeling better and that I would clean it tomorrow and that seemed to satisfy him. I cooked his dinner, we had a lovely meal and things were great. Until it came to bedtime. Usually my husband was too tired to make love in the evenings, but he was rather frisky. Delighted, I received him eagerly and mid thrust he stopped. The poor man could hardly touch the sides. My new toy had stretched me so much. <laughs> Immediately he pulled out and began shouting at me, accusing me of sleeping with someone else while he was away. Am I not good enough for you? He sobbed. I tried desperately to explain about the toy, but he shook his head. I bet he brought you that, didn't he? Your lover? God, how could I have been so stupid as to trust you? He simply wouldn't listen to reason and in the end I had to leave. I packed a bag and left for my mother's in Norfolk. I now live with my oh, I, li I now live with my mother's loft conversion in her bungalow, with nothing for company then but Mr. Dick. I married straight out of school and I have no formal qualifications other than my GCSEs. Okay, so I'm assuming she's from the UK. So finding work has proved impossible. My children, now grown up, won't talk to me because of what they think I did to their father. But despite all that, I would still recommend the product <laughs> Use with Caution. <laughs> and this is by Distraught from Mum's Attic, Norfolk, UK, age 45 to 54, gender female. Power, she gave it a rating uh, 5 out of 5. Quietness, 4 out of 5. Orgasm, 5 out of 5. Quality, 4 out of 5. <laughs> the comments are just even worse. Like, if you ever need to talk to me, I'm here for you. By airtight. Uh. So yeah, that's it. I just thought I should share that with you. And uh, yeah, see you later.